Do do do. Children. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm creeping you out. But today I'm gonna be doing my November favorites Instagram. Not enough to go on my shirt, but just enough to where you can see my face. I know I'm late. But don't judge me, please. And my Christmas tree is chilling. Oh god. Oh, there's like a mirror thing, so it's like I don't really know where I'm going. Okay. But anyway, I'm doing my November favorites. And so yeah. Let's get into it. So I'm gonna start with my beauty favorites. I'm gonna start with the body favorite and I have this lotion from Bath and Body Works in Twisted Peppermint and they have their creepy new dispensers which don't make any freaking sense I don't understand this but they're like rectangle now instead of circle which is kinda creepy but at least they can fit their whole thing on the lid and the tiny ones they don't say exactly what's supposed to smell like but okay Yeah. It smells good, I guess. I don't know. Okay, and then next I have a fragrance. This is also from Bath and Body Works. This is Forever Red little mini size that I got last year. It's almost up. I think I'm gonna need to go buy a new one. Or something, but I thought they had like a new Forever Red like rum or something. I was so confused what it was. I was like, I don't want freaking alcohol being sprayed everywhere. But, you know, it might smell good, so you know, Christmas shopping, can I go and try that out? And I might get a little tiny size like this. Because this is the 10 ounce, no, only 25 ounce. I don't know why I said 10 ounce. It was 10 bucks, that's what it was. And this is a pretty good size, and it's lasted me about a year, and this is like, I use it like, this is a pretty daily spray. I don't use like perfume every single day, but when I do, I usually put this one on, because it smells amazing. Like, I don't know. I don't know. It just smells so good. I can't describe it. <laughs> okay. And then next I have... I have three eye products. Um, so start with the first one. This is pretty much what I use for all my, um, face increase. It's my Little Black Beauty Book Warm Edition by e.l.f. For, uh, huh, huh, huh. Um, it's kind of ripped stuff. I got this last year, and... I have used the butt out of it. It is an amazing palette. Um, I've hit pan on three colors, I think. No, I've hit pan on one color and then two. I'm really close to hitting pan on. Just as we, I don't know why, but it's like the weirdest color. I, I've almost hit pan on this turquoise color, and then I've almost hit pan on this champagne cup, like the champagne cup in the corner. But yeah, what I've been doing, um, I've been getting this tan color and putting that on my lids. And then I've been taking this mm -mm, this color right here and putting it in the crease. And then my next product I've been putting it on the outer corners is the NYX eyeshadow in Fantasy. And it's like this shimmery gold color, and I've been putting this on like the outer corners, and it works really well. And I don't know because the other ones are like grayish, and so this sparkle just like brings out the eyes. And some days I don't do an out the outer color, which is why this hasn't been used. Like, it doesn't look that much used, just because I don't use it every single day when I want, like, a more subtle look. I'll just do that, but I won't add that. And then there's an eyeliner that I've been loving to use on my waterline, which is the Jordana White Eyeliner, which I've been talking about, I've talked about before, and it's, it's pretty good. I mean, it's not the best eyeliner I've ever tried. I've had better luck with other eyeliners. But this is pretty good considering it's only a buck and yeah. And it's about just the same as about almost every other drugstore eyeliner. Except I'd have to say the wet and wild ones are better than this. And they're like a dollar twenty, I think. But this was all that was available when I went to the drugstore. I got this and the black one seems to work better than the white one. I don't know. It might be because it's a darker color. It shows up better. I feel like I'm not staring at the camera at all and I'm probably not. Yeah, and then I have 
I have a lip product too, and this is the Revlon Just Bit and Kiss for Bomb Stain and Charm, which is like this light peachy pink color. It's really pretty, and it smells like mint, which I like. I don't know a lot. It almost seems like almost every single like bomb stain or like lipstick or something that comes in like this form always smells like mint because I have one from Pop Beauty and it smells like mint. The one that I have from Be a Bombshell smells like mint. I don't know what it is, but it just smells like mint. And my other product is actually over here because I just painted my nails. Oh. All over. I feel like I'm bouncing around everywhere. But it is this nail polish. It is the Simple Colors Social Ladder, which is like the sparkly um, it's like a sparkly light pink with like <laughs> reflectors on it and it's really pretty. And I'm wearing like two coats of it on my nails and so it's not really thick. And you can still kind of see my nails through it. But I don't really care because I got, I was tired of painting my nails after like two coats. So, yeah, but these are like two bucks at the drugstore and they're, they seem to, to me they seem better, they're better than China Glaze. I don't know. They came, they came in the same like packaging look and they have almost the exact same colors but they seem better because they don't chip off China Glaze chips. I don't know. It might just be the place that me and Joanna buy our China Glazes that they chip, but China Glaze is just not that good of a nail polish brand to me. And also it dyed my nails right before um, I had to go to a wedding. So I had to like sit there scrubbing my nails for two and a half hours because the blue would not come off my nails. Because it had like a top bottom layer because I had separated them, so I got the sparkles there off, just not dark blue blue, which I wanted to get off. So, yeah. And then I start getting into my non beauty favorites, which is this is going to be a really long video. But I'm going to start off with this watch, and it is a Garmin, I don't know what the flip it is, watch. And it has two settings it has that it has power save and regular, which is like a blue color. Green, and it's lime green, and this is like a running watch, so it counts your steps and everything, but I'm not a runner, and I don't really run anymore. So, yeah. So, but this is just really cute, I guess, that's why I wear it. And I can tell time, because the clocks, my teacher's clocks always break, and so I can never tell time. And what's convenient about this is that um, you can charge it, you plug the little charger into your USB thing for your computer, and it'll charge for you. And right now it is 910. 919, whoa. This one said 910, like 10 seconds ago. Okay, the next thing I have is a sweater from American Eagle. I'm going to sit up for this. It is this sweater from American Eagle. And it's like, just like a crew neck purple sweater. And it has like metallic American Eagle on it. Because so I just wanted a basic top that said American Eagle. But then I wanted really wanted a sweater from American Eagle, and then you know, the top really fit me right, and I saw this and I was like, boom, it works out. Um, yeah, and then this is my next favorite, and I think you might have seen this before. I don't know. It's just my husky hat, and it's a hat, a scarf if I want it to be, and also mittens if I want it to be. I can stick my hand between the which is very convenient. But I don't usually use it as a scarf. And I rarely use it as mint. I just use it to hold my hands like I'm doing this or something. I don't know. But I think it's really adorable. And this part is coming up. This part right here is coming This part is coming up. But yeah. This has been a favorite time. I wear a lot and my hair is going crazy now. Okay. And there's a few things that I don't have right now. Because they're like being refrigerated and things like that. Or they're just not here. And so I have a movie. The movie is Catching Fire. I saw it um, one opening night and it was amazing. And <laughs> yeah. Um, and then another one is the. It's the new like special coffee creamers from. Um, but it's a coffee creamer brand, and it's this, um, it's the gingerbread latte thing, and it's delicious, just by the way. And then also, I have three favorite songs. The first one 
is probably it's pretty good. It's um along together by Fallout Fallout what? I think, yeah. Okay. Next one. Next one is um Monster by Rihanna and it and 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 and, 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 and yeah. Whatever. Fudgeables. Okay, there we go. And then the last one is by the neighborhood and it's sweater weather, which I think is pretty a popular song by everyone.